Welcome back guys to CryptoFly channel. Today we'll talk about Compound. Should we buy this token for a long run? We will talk about a plan for 2023 and double check what's going on with my indicator set on a highest time frame. Let's dive in. First of all, let's start with the basic analysis and basic FIB. So here we got a top in May and like I told you before, the top of uh, bull market was in April and May. Here, the compound in May was around 900 per coin. And in November, when the old market is crash and Bitcoin just forming double top, uh, here, the compound was at 365. So some altcoins, yes, pump it higher and follow the Bitcoin, some not. So if we take a look on this uh, FIB, so here's a top, here's a drop, to zero level and here is impulse correction to 38 level by FIB. So this FIB is still relevant. Now we trade from May to Sound 22. We trade in the 27 zone. So almost one year we are in accumulation stage in 27 zone. So basically like you always know from my videos, 27 zone on different time frames uh, works like accumulation stage. So it doesn't mean we can't drop much, much lower, but uh, to everybody who think here at 197 after this drop it's a bottom and start buying it they collapse once again and lose money so uh, the potential of drop uh, we can see even five dollars per compound so it's 27 so like you can see here we drop we get one reaction at 0 0.18 level of FIP, second reaction rejection and we didn't test the 27 line of FIP. So we trade in this just a range, you know, but as much as possible, we test some uh, level, it's become weaker. So we have more chances to breaking out this level. This is a FIB relevant. And according to just the, the FIB, what we can see, uh, usually we walk from level to level. So 38 level by FIB traded, 23 level by FIB traded. So basically we can see zero level 197 and 0 0.5 level by FIB. And we will be still in a downtrend, even if we test the 0 0.5 level by FIB. Of course, now it's hard to imagine the compound can reach uh, 550 now, but uh, we talk for a long run. So for 2023, we can see at least, it just at least we can see, if we will see the altcoin season, we can see the move to uh, 18 level by FIB once again. So it's minimal price target, it's 62%. Zero level, it's a 362% pump. So this is two targets is a minimal what we can see. It can be something like this one. It's just minimal targets, you know. Uh, we already, I guess we're already breaking out here at the line chart and we can make a line like this one, for example. So we're already breaking out, you know, the line in May. We can make a move like this one here in the March zone 22. So we're breaking out, retest and going a sideways one, uh, one year, almost one year. Also, we can hide this FIB and take a look on a FIB extension, trend extension. Here is a top. Here's a reaction, first reaction. We can find out we almost tested a 38 level by FIB. So it's a $20.82. Uh, so if the market collapse, we can drop even to $20 and even drop to $5. So just keep in mind this scenario. I don't want to make a fundamental analysis. So we just double check the technical picture for this coin. But you have to know the total supply only 10 millions, only 10 millions and 73% in circulation supply. So this coin definitely have a potential. And for everybody who think it's unreal to hit uh, 550 price, it's just 1k and 200% from this current price. It's not a necessary, so we have to be the previous high, you know? So not all altcoins in next bull run will beat the previous all-time high. So just keep in mind, but most of them just make a correction to 0.5 level by FIP or even 61. So more than 1K percent, you can see on compound. Some people start uh, thinking, oh, we have to go to 1.61 level by FIP and 2.61. No, it doesn't work like this because uh, we we got a new and new projects. Why I'm talking like that? Because you have to understand uh, some coins which was in top 10 or in top 20 in 2017, now they can be out of top 50 
or even top 100. So just keep in mind this scenario. So not all altcoins will beat previous all-time high. So it's not an asterisk, it's not an option. So let's go to indicators. So let's start with ADZ. Here we form the huge divergency on a weekly time frame. Every single time it's a bullish signal. Here in the February 2022, at the beginning of uh, previous year, we was at the bottom here uh, $93. Then till June, we drop it to 25, 25, 26 here. And we form a huge divergency because on ADZ, the big players accumulate a lot. Here's how it works. Here, the biggest accumulation ever, what we ever seen on uh, a compound was in March, 2020. Here at uh, almost 100, almost 100 price. Then in uh, June, we drop it to 25. The big players accumulate more. So the average price now can be here around 70, 70 per compound. Then we drop it down once again. So we can go to the monthly time frame. And on a monthly time frame, we are in, still in accumulation stage. Still in accumulation stage, in, not in distribution. So the people who are selling it now, they can make a mistake. Of course, we can drop every, every, every single time we have a chance to drop lower. But now we're in a great condition. More than one year, we're in accumulation stage, even on a monthly time frame or on a, or on a weekly time frame. Also, we can move like this one, you know, on ADZ. Still divergency, still divergency from this price till this one, still divergency. Uh, it's, a, it's a bullish signal, it's a bullish signal. Last time we was in distribution here in uh, at uh, five, 570. So this time was distribution. Then we start forming divergency, huge divergency on a weekly time frame. This is how it works. So now it works in opposite way. So it's totally bullish, bullish signal. All right, so let's go to uh, weekly time frame, uh, crypto fly direction. What do we got? We got no no signal to to sell, but now we got two signal to buy on a weekly. We got here uh, here is accumulation in August and signal to buy this candle pump uh, when we retested 18 level by feet, and here is accumulation in December from December till January, and one more. Cattle, huge pump uh, on a weekly. On a monthly time frame, we lay down on the bottom. So let's go to a weekly time frame and market mode. Market mode, yes, everything bullish, everything now bullish. This was distribution period from 2020 till uh, May 2021. Distribution, and we are in accumulation stage from, from December 2021 here. From this level, from zero level, we are in accumulation stage. So every single time when you see uh, on the market mode, white color, it's time to buy. If you use DCA strategy, money power. I'm not analyzing money power because money power it's more for uh, you know for swing trades, not for investment. You can use the money power on uh, smaller time frames, you know, to determine the top or the bottom, you know, when to buy or uh, when to sell it. Because we can see the money inflow. But it's it almost uh, doesn't change the situation on a on a price chart. So here, yes, of course, we start accumulate here in December. We make a bump from thirty till uh, sixty one, so one hundred uh, percent pump, and we're at the top. But we can trade long term period here. That's why let's go to trade on indicator. What does this indicator shows? Uh, here's how it play out. We got. Three signal to uh, sell at the top when we uh, see the ADZ distribution here at 500 and then the last call to sell uh, at the top at the top and now we got signal to close position here is close position close position no signal to buy on a weekly time frame of course on a daily time frame we got a local signal to buy take profit sell uh, recommendation close position but for us now most important for investors not for traders uh, important to double check weekly time frame and a monthly time frame on a monthly time frame no signal at all so now we can analyze only the weekly and let's go to the last one it's take profit indicator on a daily time frame yes of course uh, we are uh, here 
touch the take profit. Here's a buy line, buy line, buy line, buy line, exit, 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 exit. So it's not necessary. So we have to test one more time the buy line. Buy line now for compound $32 uh, per coin. Uh, fundamental price uh, for compound now on the daily time frame is 24, 24, 25. So it's lower than this low. So yes, we have all chances to crash like this one. Of course, we have a chance to drop to 20 cents and collapse, uh, well, I guess, 50%. Yeah, yes, 45%. Yes, we have all chance to collapse like this one, but uh, it's not an option, so we have to drop it. If the Bitcoin hit the top and go into con consolidation or in correction, and we will see the altcoin season, we have all chances for compound. What a market, we have all chances to see. Uh, on a weekly time frame, we can determine on take profit indicator. Here's a uh, fundamental price, 63, buy line 82, these lines are dynamic, you know. Uh, take profit line 165 and exit line is 187. So with a weak candle, we can test zero level. Yes, of course, it's hard to believe now. So from this current price, we can hit over than 357%, but it's it's real, it's more than real, you know. And on a monthly time frame, no data for a compound for this indicator. So I showed you my targets for compounds. Don't rush uh, to go all in. But if you believe in compound, I think we are now in a good condition, even if we drop much, much lower. So guys, I hope you like this video about compound. Subscribe channel, hit the like button, hit the notification button. If you want to trade with my custom indicator set six in one, only for $1 per day, just write in the end. And see you next time.